Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your second week of February reading start from the 8th to the 14th of February 2021. This is going to be for the sign of uh, Aquarius. So let's see what is coming up for you guys for this week time. I will be adding oracle cards in this reading but no charms will be added so stay tuned and uh, while I shuffle the cards let me remind you it's a general reading it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Always pick the messages which are resonating and leave the rest. For personal readings, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So let's see what is heading for the Aquarians for this week time. Um, hold on. Yep, let's begin. Aquarians. Six of Wands. You would feel as if you have conquered something. It can be conquered your inner uh, fears. It can be uh, coming out of a situation which was causing a lot of stress in your life. And now you are like, you know, you have conquered your fears, your anxieties around that situation. You are coming out of it as a winner as well. Um, I do see that, you know, you will be feeling very strong. Maybe the, the fight that you were in, be that inner fight, fight with the other people, arguments, uh, debates, whatever it was that you came that you came out of, it's it's uh, it has made you a stronger person. You are feeling very confident in yourself right now. Um, I do think that you know with with this new version of you, I do see you more um, confident in yourself in your decisions, and um, that confidence is basically um, making you shine right now. People are like, you know, observing you right now. People are getting um, um, attracted to you for sure. It's, it's like they see your growth. They see you have fought for it and you have come out of it, whatever it was. Be that in work life situation, home life situation, um, um, money related matters, whatever it was, you have come out as a winner for sure. Let's see more cards here. Wow, pair up with the fool, big, 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 yes. Whatever it is that you're coming out of, it, it has made you a better person, it has made you a stronger person, it has made you the better version of yourself as well. Now you're feeling fresh, now you're feeling free, now you're feeling excited. Um, as if you have conquered the world. For some of you, you might have uh, gotten some sort of results. Um, maybe you have appeared in some exams, the results were excellent, that could be the case for some of you. You might have... Uh, uh, received approval in a in a biggest firm ever maybe that you applied for so it can be something around those lines but yes you are definitely shining bright as you start of the um you know a week second week of february i do see you very positive and um you are ready you are ready to take on to your new journey uh feeling very happy and excited and i feel like you know you have um You have won the battle on your own. I don't see that you 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 had any sort of support from others. And as you have achieved whatever it was, I do think that as the time passes by, people are going to start rushing back to you. The people who left you in the past will be coming back to you. For some of you, um, maybe uh, somebody from the past might also, like an ex, would also come back in your life. I don't know what has changed in you, but something has changed for sure in you, which is now making you feel very positive. So maybe, you know, that vibe that you are generating right now, that magnetic field that you are creating around you is very powerful. It's attracting all the abundance in your life. And for that matter, maybe you are also attracting the wrong people as well in your life. Why? Because uh, they see you shine. This, they are getting attracted to you now. Um, but yes, I, I don't think that you are fool enough to give them a chance if, if they were not, you know, worthy of it. But let's see what else happening. You are the magician. You are attracting all the things that you want in your life. You are in that spot where everything is easy for you to achieve. Everything is easy for you to have. Everything is easy for you to gain, attain. Um, you are on top of the game for sure. It's, it's like some sort of a big, huge victory that you got. Let's see more cards here. Knight of Swords. With all the love, appreciation that you're getting, you do have some, you know, envious people as well, some jealous people as well. 
so just be careful with them um even though with your wife i don't think even they do you know talk shit about you it's, it shall not bother you much but i do see that there will be some people around you who would be coming in strong to hit you hard maybe maybe they do see you as their their competitor or something but um i see that you are not going to um you are not going to shit to them with your wife it's like you know you are you are wiping a bit a bit too high for them to even you know reach there so but be careful because i feel like you know they are going to try to hit you hard whoever it is <clears throat> yep they're gonna try their best to hit you hard now be careful with um they're gonna try first if they fail they're gonna try another way so be careful with the with the new people that are coming towards you or maybe with the past people coming towards you as well because somebody would be having hidden hidden agendas make sure you are very clear about the intention of the other people coming towards you around this time especially when you have achieved something for yourself because I do see that there will be a lot of people coming towards you out of which there will be some people who are jealous of you and your your success, your your freedom right now. So maybe they would be coming to attack you in one way or the other. Now, if you don't give them a shot or if you don't don't give them the uh, the try first time, they will try another way out to, to reach out to you. So. Wow. <sighs> Strange. Why they would be deceptive then? You would know what their intention is. You know, whatever they tell you, you will know if they have a pure intention or if they have the evil intention for you, you will know. Uh, but yes, I would still suggest you to be very careful because I do see many people would be attacked, uh, uh, you know, um, you will be attracting many people and there will be some who would not have positive intention for you. So just be careful with them. But yes there will be right people too attracted to you so be careful i feel like you know if you if you make a habit that you connect to your higher self every day uh, maybe you can set yourself some time for yourself where you connect to your god like you know in, in meditation maybe uh use some affirmations maybe and try to keep yourself very positive and protected that way so whenever you are connected with your god on a regular basis you will be always guided you know you will be always uh, able to sense if something fishy is going to happen you would know if there is this person around you or in your surroundings who is having ill intention for you then too you will also know so make sure you are you know aware of that kind of people around you as well but i think with your energy it seems like you know they will miss the chance to hit you hard so yeah let's see what the oracle has to add to the reading for you guys but I do see this is going to be a beautiful week for you. Confidence is your key to success. I do see you very confident. Something has happened. I feel like it's the otherwise, uh, you know, thing for you. You gained some sort of sex, uh, some some sort of success, which has basically added to your confidence, and you are now rocking it. It's time to release negativity. For some of you, you there could be some people around you who are negative. Maybe you need to let them go. You need to release them, uh, and uh, ignore them um situation people especially you know if, if maybe maybe if somebody from the past coming in who once was rude to you maybe you need to let that person go because maybe they have the uh ill intention for you now free yourself uh it's time to take back control of your life don't um, you know if, it, it's up to you if you think the past person if somebody reaches out from the past if you think they are worthy of you give them a chance if you think that they are not worthy of you or they had you know hurt you in the past so bad then maybe you you know what to do because i feel like you know with the high priest and the high priestess be that you are feminine or masculine i feel like you know you will be guided you will be um you will be able to sense what is right and what is wrong so follow your god there in terms of like you know choosing who to talk to who to mingle with make sure you know what is uh, what is right for you before you take any uh, action towards anyone so yeah this is it coming up for you for this week time if the reading resonates with you do like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye bye